In this video, I will be showing you how to create and import your custom sounds into Minecraft by using a resource pack. Resource packs allow you to change the look of a game and also its sounds. Before we start, I just want to quickly thank everyone for the great support lately. If you haven't already subscribed and also like our content, feel free to like this video and subscribe to show us your appreciation. Anyways, now we want to create some sound files in order to import them into Minecraft. If you don't already have the software for this, I'm gonna show you how to install Audacity right now. That's the handy program we will be using today. This is the official site. I put a link to it in the description of the video. Now you just need to click here and here in order to download and install the software. After having downloaded Audacity, you can open it, which will create this little window here. There you got to choose the language. Now you just need to click continue and all the settings will already be done. To start recording, all you have to do is to press this red record button. And to stop it, use the stop button. Now you can already export your file as an OGG file. It's important not to use MP3 or anything else because Minecraft only accepts those types of sound files. In my case, I have already recorded the voice I wanna use. If you already got the sound file, you can also just use this website to convert your sounds to the right file type. Link to the converter is also linked in the description down below. Click on the select file and get the sound file you would wish to convert to the OGG format. Then just convert and the site does the rest for you. Now you can download the converted sound file. Now we will be creating our resource pack that will be used in the game later. We start by pressing the Windows key and R so we can search for percent app data percent using the search bar. Now you will see all your program folders and the .minecraft one. Click on this folder and search for the resource pack folder. Now, to create your pack, you need to create a new folder and name it however you want it to be called. Now, you need to create a text document by clicking here. In this, you need to paint this byte of code. We also put that in the description, of course. See this 5 here? If your pack is made for the Minecraft version 1.16.1, then you need to have a 5 behind the pack format, just like I did. For a later version of a game, for example 1.17, you need to put a 6 there. We can now save the document and name it pack.mcmeta. Now we need to create a new folder and call it Assets. And in Assets we create another one, call it Custom. In that one we will create another folder and call it Sounds. And another text document. We can now already put our sound file in the sound folder. You can call it whatever you want it to be. In my case, I call it voice line 1 to keep them arranged in the future. After having that done, we need to go back a folder into the custom folder. The text document now needs this byte of code. Also shown in the description. Just replace voice line 1 with the name of a sound file you just given it. Replace audio 1 with how you wanna call it in game. Just make sure that two files are not call it the same. It's really important that they are not the same. If you now want to import additional ones, you can just do it like that. After that, we are almost done. Now we just need to save this text file and call it sounds.json. Now open the options, resource packs in Minecraft and select your do-it-yourself pack.
Now you can use the play sound command to play your own sounds, which will be shown here on top. The Abominator, the ship that will go down in history. There you have it folks. I hope you have enjoyed the tutorial and learned something new. Now you can give your world custom sounds, isn't that great? Since we are currently working on the second part of the Star Wars The Capsule Map, we might soon publish more tutorials. If you have any ideas for more tutorials or videos feel free to comment them below or just join our Discord server to share them with us. Thank you for watching and I'm out.